Okay, I continue here. Yep. Gonna continue. After I scratch my foot. Okay. Oh, shoot. Where did I leave off? Okay. What the heck? I'll go back a little bit. Now, nah, I've read that thing so many times already. I'll, I'll begin where the Muslim starts here. Okay. Yeah. You know, it's amazing how many times I've charged up the battery of this camera. And it seems to uh, give me as much time as usual. I, I keep on wondering when it's not going to be able to do that, but it's a fantastic little battery here, you know. How many times it's died and come back by putting that, you know, plugging it up again. You know, it's amazing. Anyway, I'll continue here. Um, I read my words I'll be using this side, and I use the Muslims that side. And uh, be focusing most of my attention on this camera here, not you. Sorry, because I feel that this video will probably be pulled off because the blamer said the future must not belong to those who had signed to the prophet of Islam. And signing the prophet of Islam is what I do, which is just expose what's in the Quran and Hadith on the internet. That's all, that's all I do. Yeah, and if, really, if, if, if what's in the Quran and Hadith doesn't uh, shine Islam in a good way, that's called signing the prophet of Islam, and you have to die. Right. Like if if if, blame, if a blamer gets his way, and he probably will, because you know people are afraid to be called racist, but they stand up against it. Even though I have nothing against his black half, it's just just stupid. I have nothing against his brilliant black half. It's his stupid anti-America Marxist Muslim white half. I can't stomach that. You know, you know that's the thing I don't like. It's the white part, not the black part. Okay, I'll continue here. Yeshua received the word of God and he transmitted them orally. Oh, so it was orally and not a book. Huh? If so, can you tell me why in Quran 1094 it says to go to those who have been reading, not reciting, but reading the before scriptures? It was not written down. If not, then again, can you tell me why in Quran 1094 it says to go to those who have been reading, not reciting, but reading the before scriptures? Yeah. Uh, people at the time, uh, people at the time uh, during the ministry of Yeshua were in the impression that the end of the time was very near, so they did not think to preserve the revealed words on to documents for future generations. Oh, like the Quran, until so many Muslims were killed in the Battle of Yamama. Not the Battle of Yamama, it's actually the Battle of Yamama. And then the Quran was written down. Uh, they didn't think that they would be killed because so many mem uh, cause they believed that Allah would uh, protect the Quran. And they thought, well, we got it in our head, so we don't have to write it down. And we go off to the battle, Allah will protect us. And they went in into the Battle of Yamama, and many of them died, so that, ooh, yeah, we better write it down. That's how in the writing. That's, according to the Hadith, that's how the Quran became a book. So many of those jihadis got killed in the war due to, the, it's kind of like the Indians thought that they wore uh, um, a special kind of t-shirt. The bullets uh, from the cavalry wouldn't hurt them, wouldn't kill them, and they were wrong. Same with the Muslims. They thought, well, we, got the, we have it in our head, the Quran. Allah will protect us. And they got wiped out, a lot of them, so they uh, put it in book form. Oh, like the Quran until so many Muslims were killed in the Battle of Yamama? Actually, Yamama. And then the Quran was written down. They preached and waited for the end of time. They were expecting it. So then what happened to Angel? Most of the New Testament or Gospel which we have now is not true Angel. Sounds like you don't trust something that is handed down orally. If so, then how can you put your trust in the Quran, the, the clear signs? Don't Muslims brag about the memory of a man being more reliable than the written word? 
or does that only mean it's preserved when someone has memorized the Quran? If so, then why did Uthman have six versions of the Quran burned, according to the Hadith? They were they are mostly heresy, written accounts of eyewitnesses. Well, the same thing happened with the Quran, and apparently uh, didn't do a good job of it since six versions of the Quran were burned by Uthman. Or do you not believe that? The author themselves were not eyewitnesses, says who? There are there are many evidences that the real authors of the New Testament Gospel were not really the disciples chosen by Yeshua. Yeshua about that. Now, I said, well, Muhammad wasn't a witness of Yeshua, nor a disciple. Yet, you believe the Quran that says Yeshua didn't go to the cross? In other words, you will believe someone 500 years after the fact, rather than those who could have been actually there, eyewitnesses? Yeah. Why the double standard, O slave of the best deceivers? Why the double standard? Of course, the angel speaks uh, about the disciples chosen by Yeshua himself. But the names Mark and Luke do not appear among these twelve. Why not? Bible scholars also have evidence to prove that other two, Matthew and John, were also two persons different from their names, says who they were. If so, so what? So the opinion that the disciples of Yeshua wrote the New Testament Gospel is suspicious to say the least. How so? Most of the accounts and letters written to people are it's about the life of Yeshua. Right. The first point to realize is what Quran talks about. That is, is that Quran talks about the revealed word in Jill given to Yeshua, the Messiah, the Messiah, not to Paul, not to Mark, not to Luke, not to John or Matthew, no, but to Yeshua himself. Right. To show yourself. Yeah. Right. Thus, since it's the New Testament that is uppermost, since it's Christians who have prevailed with the Bible, with the Bible Jesus, and not the Quran Jesus, then how can Quran 3.55 and Quran 61.14 be true about Jesus and his followers prevailing and being uppermost until the day of resurrection. Aren't those two scriptures now lies? Also, if you are right that the New Testament is not the Injil, then again, why should Jews and Christians stand firm upon the Torah and Injil? Why are Christians to use the Injil to judge their end of the Quran with Quran, uh, Quran 547? If you are right, doesn't it make the Quran a lie and a joke to come to me for my reading? Not reciting, but my reading of the before scriptures, Quran 1094. It does, doesn't it? It also makes Quran 4, 136, 150, 151, 152, 2285, and 40, 70 through 72 lies for telling you, a Muslim, to make no distinction between all his books. If the Quran is the only book of Allah that is not corrupted, face it. And the same scripture just mentions tells Muslims to believe in all the books of Allah. How can they believe in all the books of Allah if only the Quran is not corrupted? So Angel is the divine revelation given to Isa, uh, Quran, Surah 1930-33. It's interesting to note the similarity between the time of Yeshua and Muhammad. Earlier on in the teaching Yeshua, the church spread the good news orally and did not have it in written form. Like the Quran wasn't in written form until, until the battle of Yo Mama. Yo Mama, actually. I just like to call it Yo Mama here. The battle of Yo, Ma Yo, Yo Mama. Not Yo Mama. Yeah. Like the Quran until the battle of Yo Mama. Where so many Quran reciters were killed. That was decided to put the Quran into a book. Or do you not believe that hadith? And I wonder how many parts, of, I wonder how, how big the Quran would have been if they weren't killed, you know? And they put it into book before. I wonder how big the Quran would be. Or if the, if the goat didn't eat away that uh, passage in the Quran about the... Uh, oh, you know something? I better quit here. I better quit, yeah? Oh, I still have some time. I still have some time. Yeah.
Okay, I'll continue here. Yeah, some minutes left here. So, so there was no Bible in the time of Yeshua, and and and, and the only reason that they started collecting the teachings and writing down was because quote, first the apostles started to die. Oh, battle with your mama, yo mama, battle with your mama, which was actually yeah mama. That your mama, which was why they decided to put the Quran in book form, due to the reciters being killed off so much. Why the double standard? I know. Yeah, I know that your mama spelled yeah mama, but why the double standard here? Any second, uh, and, and second, and second, Yeshua's return was evidently not going to happen within the first decade first few decades of the church's existence as they had imagined did you know that Muhammad thought the end times were in his time as well I bet you didn't know that did you and they weren't expecting him to die and uh, actually he was poisoned they didn't expect him to be poisoned either and that's why the, and because he died and there was no successor they could create the Shiite Sunni divide here yeah they didn't expect him to die, but he did. And then, because he was poisoned to death. It took him three years to die after eating that poison, though. I bet he died of diabetes since he was eating agile dates in the morning to protect him all day from both magic and poison. I'm almost done here. Yeah. R. V. J. Tasker, Professor of New Testament Exegesis at the University of London says, quote, there were at least 35 years of Christian teaching and Christian missionary activity before the believers were in possession of the written record of Christ's life and teaching. If so, then what is this hundreds of years after the fact of nonsense? You know? What's this hundreds of years after the fact of nonsense? Which we know as the four Gospels. Taskers are VG. Quote, the nature and purpose of the Gospels, page 9. If so, then again, if again, what is this hundreds of years after the fact nonsense? Can't they get their story straight? You know? He says it's, <laughs> you know, really. He said, uh, but there were at least 35 years of Christian teaching and Christian missionary activity before the believers were in possession of a written records. Uh, well, it's just hundreds of years after that there were written records. Come on here can't get their story straight. Oh, I better stop it here. Is it time? Oh yeah it is. Okay. Bye.